What is the difference between hemoglobin A1c and fasting blood glucose testing? A question that I often get asked by patients is what is the difference between the hemoglobin A1c number and a fasting blood glucose number? Let's take an example. If you went to a party and you had a piece of cake, and you check your sugar after an hour or two after you check the after you had the cake, you'll find that the blood glucose is elevated. Then the next day, you wake up in the morning, haven't eaten since dinner, you check your blood glucose, and your blood glucose has dropped down. This is often what happens with blood glucose. The fasting blood glucose number is an instantaneous measurement of what how much sugar is in your blood at that given moment. That number can vary up and down based on what you eat and what you've done that day. A hemoglobin A1c is a number that's an average of about four months of how your blood sugars are running. So even if your blood sugars go up and down on a daily basis, you could still have a very well-maintained average number because you've done well on other days. Both of these numbers are important. The fasting blood glucose number is an important number for patients to know because it tells them whether what they had to eat or how they behave, whether they exercise or not, is doing to them at that moment. The A1C test is another number that the patients need to know because it tells them whether their lifestyle over the course of the last three or four months is keeping the sugars in good check or not. The, A1, the A1C and the fast, fasting blood glucose are both very important numbers for a diabetic to know.